Hey YouTube, I'm RJ and you're watching 87R Johns. It has been far too long since I have filmed a video and I am so sorry about that. I have still been watching YouTube videos before I get into bed, but as far as having time to shop at the Dollar Tree and film, it's such a crazy time of year, which is not an excuse, so that's why I made myself go to the Dollar Tree in between the gym and the grocery store today, and I squeezed it in because there was some pretty cool stuff there. So I'll show you what I got. Um, I got two bags worth of things. We'll just go through the bag. First of all, like I said, it was like in the order of the errands I had to run today, and I didn't get a chance to eat dinner, so I picked up these rice crackers snack mix, and I actually like opened it upside down, like that's how hurried I was to get into it. Um, I was doing my best not to buy some candy, um, just trying to stay healthy, and I don't really know that these are healthy, but I assumed that they were a better choice than candy. Um... I mean, like, all the ingredients seem to be pretty natural, and I do like rice crackers. They weren't, like, the best rice crackers I've had, though. I mean, they're just not that high of quality, so that was those. Um, then I got this sucker, which I just talked about trying to eat healthy, and then BAM! But, like, can you say no? Look at that. This is a sucker for a grown-up woman. I don't know if I'm going to eat this or give it to one of my students. I like I kind of want to eat it that's a lot of sucker though so like I don't really know it's called the twist lollipop just look at it so cute right okay so then I got um, this gnocchi I picked it up several times I really like this if you enjoy gnocchi then this is a really great deal I like I said I went grocery shopping as well and so I picked this up for a dollar and then right afterwards I was at the grocery store and the cheapest I could find at the grocery store was like three fifty. dollars so a dollar is a really great deal for Noki and I think the quality is great next I picked up a set of retractable headphones I got them in purple to match the decor of my classroom so that I can identify them no they're mine I'll probably also write um, my last name on there. These are to keep in my classroom um, for students who, for whatever reason, if I'm assigning them to watch a video or something, I have an extra pair of headphones. I picked up this tape. I think it is so cute and it really reminded me of um, one of my friends here on YouTube and I thought this would be so cute to either like wrap a present for her or um, just send it to her. Who do you think it's for? Like, tell me who you think this matches. <laughs> Um, next I picked up these two containers for a different friend, a non-YouTube friend. They have a small child and they like give her little bits of cereal and she doesn't eat it all. And I mentioned, well, hey, like the Dollar Tree probably has some containers for those. So for the extra cereal in here, I did have to check them to make sure the lids like did a good snap closure and it was sealed. But I mean, you can open it up. I don't really want to mess with this, but like the whole top comes off and you can pour it right in and then for easy access, the top. So I picked these up for a friend. Um, next I got a pack of light bulbs, two in here. And then I got this flower book. I think it is really neat. I plan to keep it on my coffee table right over here. It really just matches like the clean, chic style that we try to accomplish in our apartment, but it also gives um, flower decor like ideas. And I really liked the interior design in here. So let me find a picture that I thought was really pretty. <laughs> and I just passed one called the sexy pot. I don't know what flower arrangement that was. Um, but I don't know, I just think the home decor is really nice. And I think it's a really great coffee table book. There were only two of these called Flowers Chic and Cheap by Carlos Moda. I'm really excited about this. I got one other book and it's also to send to someone from YouTube so I'm not going to show it because I know that they watch my videos. So that was my small haul. I was really sad that there were no beauty items that I wanted to pick up. They just didn't even have hardly any LA Color stuff. So that just tells you how little selection they had. So I'm definitely going to be going again probably this week. Um, and so look forward to a haul again soon because I am craving some good beauty finds. Let me know what I should be on the lookout for um, in the down bar if you guys have found any good things. So until next time, bye guys.